hungry, packed so large that he has to be wheeled around. This sounds like your average Walmart weirdo. But no, today we are talking about Grisos Coltud of the Ogres. He is the chief ogre tyrant and of all of the ogre kingdoms and he brings forward to the table some juicy, juicy knowledge. Primarily, we know the factions that the ogres have which include manipulation of campaign mechanics such as movement, campaign speed, such as the ability to buff their units, such as the ability to affect relationships with other factions and having to carry out mercenary quests that gives them gold and resources. What Grisus also brings to the table is the diplomatic relations with every other ogre kingdom, the income from trade, the unit mass increase for all of his units, which is more effective than one would think in Total War Warhammer 3. Bavandi on this Lord of Facts himself increases raiding, increases, increases the upkeep of Iron God units and Sacking and looting settlements gives you 50% more income. What else do you want to have from Greece's Golden? I say not much more. Ladies and gentlemen, this is why you should play with the ogres. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again shortly.